Hi friends, it's Dr. Tim and today we'll begin our series on biochemistry. We'll be answering the question, what is biochemistry? And we'll be discussing about um, the levels of structural organization. So first of all, what is biochemistry? Biochemistry is defined as the chemistry of life. The word bio refers to life. So biochemistry, the chemistry of life. So for a more textbook like definition all right biochemistry is defined as the study of life at the molecular level the study of life at the molecular level all right so to understand that textbook definition we have to know what the levels of structural organization are and that's what i'm illustrating here the levels of structural organization so you are something you might already know right that um full a full multicellular a full multicellular organism, excuse me, a full multicellular organism like animals, like plants, right, can be broken down into systems, right, like, like the circulatory system, respiratory system, the endocrine system, uh, reproductive system, etc. Alright, and those systems can be broken down into organs, right, like the heart in the circulatory system, the, the lungs in the respiratory system, etc. Alright, now these organs now are made up of what? Tissues, right? Tissues, right? And there are four primary tissues in the body. I had to just point that out. There are four primary tissues in the body. The acronym is semen. The four primary tissues in the body. The acronym is semen. C for connective, M for muscular, E for epithelial, N for nervous. Semen. All right. Moving down the levels. The next level we have is the cells. So tissues are made up of cells, right? So cells, so there are different cells in the body. Just mentioned like the right, red blood cells, the white blood cells, the platelets. All right. So, and then moving down, be, all right, below. After cells, you have molecules. So molecules make up you know cells. So there are four main molecules, and I put uh, a star here indicating that this is our emphasis. Right, there are four major molecules that are called macromolecules or biomolecules. We'll talk about that in the next videos. All right, so the four major molecules are what we have the lipids, the proteins, carbohydrates, and nucleic acid. And then these macromolecules or these biomolecules or these molecules are made up of you know elements or atoms. All right, talk about, about that in subsequent videos. Okay, but what 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 brought us here was that. Biochemistry is defined as as the study of life, excuse me, the study of life at the molecular level. You get so when you're studying, let's assume when you're studying something like the heart, like the heart, like probably at your school you have um a gross museum like we do. Like you can see a model of the heart. You're studying the heart, uh that in the at, at, at the level you can see, right? Yes, if you're studying the heart, that's so that would be something like you're studying an organ. So that would be gross anatomy. Right, something called gross anatomy is a, is a course in the school I went to. So, but if you're studying um, tissues, it's called histology. Histology. Histology is the study of tissues, right? If you are studying cells, it's called cytology. Anything is cyte, C Y T E, is um, cells, study of cells, cytology. But then, when you're studying the body, but you're doing it at the molecular level, that's biochemistry. So, so with that, we come to the end of this video. Um, we said that biochemistry is the chemistry of life and the study of life at the molecular level. Thanks for watching.